next line here we will be taking up how actually uh, if there are large numbers how will you be naming or how will you be recognizing that large numbers first of all the a to the recognition we already learned is comma now the second a i'll give you an i'll give you an example and teach you okay you can see that number is something 276348 to more clearly represent i give the number as okay now you can say okay this number is having something with 2 then with something with 76 and then something with 348 so let us take this example here huh? and try to represent the number in the place values okay now as the highest number has come or the leftmost digit has come in the lakhs position it's clear that this represent 2 lakhs then 76 348 okay so this gives you like a place value is more uh, of an aid to how to represent a number or how to recognize a number let us take one more example okay so with the indian system of numeration from the right most the first comma comes after three digit and the second subsequent commas comes after two digit let me place this number here okay so let me arrange this in the place value okay so this number is something related with 32 because it lacks so 32 lacks then something related to 76 76000 300 and 48 okay let us take one more example of a number same application start from the three digit then the comma should be after every two digit so here let me write the number okay starting here i'll put the number 348 the next number is 76 the next number is 32 and then 4 okay so this has something with related to 4 and at is in as it is in the place value of crore this number becomes 4 crore then 
32 lakhs. Seventy six thousand three hundred and forty eight. Let me take one more example. The rules remain same. First comma after three digit, next comma after every two digits. Let me put the number here. Starting with the hundreds, then with the thousands, then with the lakhs, and then with the crores. So here you can say that this is 84 crore. thirty two lakhs seventy six thousand three hundred and forty eight I hope you have enjoyed this session. Now let me revise uh, it again what we have learned this in this session. In this session first we have discussed about what is 1 lakh. 1 lakh is, denote, is the smallest uh, 6 digit number which comes when we add 1 to 99,919 which is the largest 5 digit number. When we come to crore, 1 crore is denoted by 1 with uh, one with uh, seven zeros that is it is the eighth eight uh, smallest uh, dig, uh, smallest digit number to the international system of numbers one million is denoted uh, is one thousand times one thousand that is it's more of an Indian system representation of ten lakhs and one billion is one thousand times one million or you can say one thousand millions now, we already have gone through uh, the what are hundreds, thousand lakhs, crores, when the Indian system of numeration and what is hundred thousand million billion in international system of numeration. Let me, let me just revise the comma rule. The comma rule for Indian system of numeration is from the right, the first comma is placed after the three digits, that is the hundred, and the second comma and subsequent commas are placed after every two digits. In international system of numeration, the first comma is placed after three digits from right and the uh, subsequent commas are also placed after three digits in the international system of numeration. Let me take up the next example like how we should write the numbers or how we recognize the number with ease. To Put the numbers in ease. First, what I had, uh, what I explained to you is, let us try and put the commas for it. Once we put the commas for it, let us put those number into those place values, place value table, and then depending upon the place value, can determine.